Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing returning subs, my extended family, thank you so much for the beautiful vibes, the prayers, and just the blessings that you're sending me that I'm sending you in return. It is all greatly appreciated. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell you know know when you're uploading um to know when i'm uploading my next video and if you feel like that you are comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two i love to get the positive feedback i love to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about you know your empathic gift or if the video uh, gave you some kind of validation and gave you some good spirits, you know, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. I've been forgetting to put that in my videos lately. But like and even share if you feel like, you know, it really gave you good meaning. So don't be stingy, spread the word. <laughs> so thank you so much for stopping by my channel today, and I hope you're able to get something out of this content of my video. And the music I'm listening to today is for... 528 hertz brings positive transformation, repairs DNA, and healing mir miracle tone. So I'll post that link in the description box below if you'd like to meditate and stuff like that. And yes, my video today is about Twin Flame 101. All empaths. Um, all in oh my goodness, I forgot what I put, y'all. I put so many things. I got my stuff written down. I'm so sorry. Um, all empaths stepping out of the matrix. Yes. I've just been talking about so much stuff. I said, okay, I got it done. I closed my book and forgot about that quick. Yeah, stepping out of the matrix. We're actually seeing things for what they truly are. And I mean, when we think about the matrix, you're thinking about all these weird numbers and, you know, seeing Morpheus and, you know, Neo and, you know, all these, you know, different things. But it's just like, we have been programmed for so many years to believe in certain things, to stay away from certain things. We place fears and limitations on ourselves that, you know, you can finally say, you know what, bump that. <laughs> I'm seeing things for what they truly are. You know, the government d does their little uh, theories. You know, they, they throw stuff out there for when they don't want to want to let us know what truly is going on. I know that might be a central, sensitive subject, but shoot, it's the truth. And I'm speaking my opinion. I can, I have a right to do that. But I'm just saying, I mean, when we go around, I'm not too much of a TV watcher, but when I did, you know, it was like certain things that was going on. The Zika, 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 uh, what is it? Zika virus, the Ebola virus, you know, um, measles, you know, uh, tuberculosis was coming back, you know, and all these things. And all of a sudden we don't hear about them anymore. I'm like, what the heck were y'all covering up? What, what did you need to do to set out a world panic? What were you trying to cover up or destroy? So you could throw us off and, you know, it, you know, we'll hear something about police brutality, somebody getting shot up and trying to find justice. But then we don't hear anything else about these news coverages anymore. We don't hear nothing about the information unless you're going to go look it up. Because there's always something that tries to control us to seeing things a certain way, believing things in a certain way, doing things a certain way, staying divided. You know, if they want, you know, mass chaos in the world, they know how to do it. Trust me. They'll pull out some stuff that, you know, aggravate, you know, one one religion or to another one or one ethnic background from another. You know, it, it's just like it's too much. We have to be able to see past the limited beliefs. When you have put your mind into po to the point where you know everything is unlimited, access to you is you know I mean positive stuff you know I'm not talking about oh yeah I can go out and get these diamonds <laughs> no that's not what I'm talking about so don't be trying to go to jail and say Rosalind told you to do that no I ain't tell you that but I'm just saying you actually seeing things for what they truly are 
You know, you're seeing masks taken off. You know, you're seeing people for who they truly are. You're seeing things that you have never noticed before, like, aha, it was an aha moment. You know, we have those moments, and it's just like, how long is it going to be where people are controlled or they put their they put leashes on themselves because somebody told them to do that people are like no they didn't yes they did because just because somebody told you oh don't do this because this is gonna you know they could actually be blocking you from something very great but you have to be able to see that for yourself look at things for what they truly are and it's just you have to believe in it you know know that things are not all as that you know that they seem you know it's just like people they try to say oh there's no aliens and stuff like that and out in the world but i'm just like we don't know whatever if it's god or whoever you know came up with all these different creatures and humans and species and you know all these different things you don't we don't know what is out there we don't know what dimensions are out there it's just like with me, the way I used to think about it, especially when it came to horror movies, when it came out to like Dracula or Frankenstein or the Wolfman or, you know, mummies and stuff like that. They had to have gotten them from somewhere for them to have to either witness it, either dream it or something they read. So trust and believe there's far more out there than, you know, we can even just process our minds to. So I hope you were able to get something out of that message. You know, you have a good week. Oh my gosh, I got something in my eye. We all have a good week. Um, blessed weekend. You know, relax, parlay, turn up, but just make sure you're responsible. Send out as much love and light and positivity while you're doing it. Know that you are loved. Know you are truly blessed and highly favored. And you are truly loved. And know there is somebody out there that is praying for you for better days. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Give me a thumbs up. Even share. It's all greatly appreciated. And drop me a line. I love the chance to hear from you. And I'll talk to you later. Peace. And be wild.